these years, all of this time, still you got all my attention. I'm feeling it too when you walk by, touching my hand like you need it. Across the room, catching my eye, already know what you're thinking. Cause I know all of your secrets. How you talk in your sleep, play the songs on repeat till you know every single word. Those commercials you like, how they all make you cry, how you need a little space when you're hurt. The way that your head falls in the morning when you first wake up, the way that I Watch you get dressed, know we got plans, we can break up I send a text to all of our friends, tell them we're not gonna make it All of these years, all of this time, so you got all my attention Yeah, you got all my attention The way that your head falls in the morning when you first wake up The way that I know all of the weird things in your coffee cup I love the way I know that you're lying, the way that you're smiling I love that I know you like no one does Like no one does How you talk in your sleep Play the songs on repeat Till you know every single word What you hate, what you like I see all of your sides And the new ones I'm trying to learn the way that your head falls in the morning when you first wake up the way that i know all of the weird things in your coffee cup i love the way i know that you're lying the way that you're smiling darling i love that i know you but no one does
Welcome family and friends. Today is a celebration of love, commitment, friendship, family, and two people who are in it forever. The marriage ceremony has been important across every culture. We have thousands of important moments that happen throughout our lives, but this one is re regarded as one so critical we acknowledge its special status by sharing it with others. Why this moment? Because despite all of our differences, love is what we all share. It's the great unifier in universal truth. No matter who we are, where we come from, what we believe, we know one thing. Love is what we're doing right. That's why both of you are standing here today. All of us have our own love stories. Some are short, others long. Some are unwritten. Well, Violet. <laughs> well, others are just getting to the good part. There are chapters in all of our stories that are sad or disappointing, and others that are exciting and full of adventures. Sam and Eula's adventures started in high school. Sam was that guy that hit on his best friend's little sister. Oh my God. <laughs> Their love continued to grow on the track field, the dance floor. <laughs> From Missoula to Spokane, the two were together. Through ups and downs, <laughs> they stuck by each other. Sam literally carried Eula on his back when she couldn't walk. And I'm sure Eula would do the same. <laughs> and that brings him here to this moment it's not one moment it's every moment big ones like saying i love you moving in together getting engaged but mostly millions of little ones making dinner together getting a big hug when you get home from work these everyday moments fuse together into one big experience and even though this experience is incredible, words fail us when we try to explain it. That's just the way, oops, that's just the way it is with love. It's meant to be felt, not described. And we feel it here. Before we start the lighting of the unity candle, I first want to share a few thoughts on marriage. Eula and Sam, as a couple, you are responsible for loving each other not changing each other. While some days may be harder than others, try to respond to each other's actions with patience and understanding. You need to demonstrate teamwork like the 86 Celtics. <laughs> Share chores and household duties. Bear each other's burdens. Offer comfort and encouragement during difficult times. Don't get sucked into believing you're responsible for your spouse's happiness. Only they can experience their emotions and make decisions for themselves. And lastly, make sure to extend grace when the other neglects to do their part. Extend grace the way you prefer to receive it. Christine and Sonny, please join us up here for the lighting of the unity candle. <laughs>
represents each of your unique selves. They symbolize who you are at this very moment and all that you will be. By lighting a third candle, the couple has made the promise of unity. It is the two of you coming together as one to create new light and new promise. You have come together as individuals to create something new, something stronger and more bold. This is also a symbol of commitment because it takes both of your fires working together to keep it ablaze. Should I go slower? Uh, Karen, Karen and Scott, <laughs> please join us for the veil ceremony. You ready? Come close. To me. <laughs> Yellow. <laughs> Get the mic over there. <laughs> 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 I can't. <laughs> Stop. All right, we'll try to <laughs> <laughs> this act of laying a veil over you allows you to be clothed as one. Let this veil represent support. Represent the support from friends and family who cover you in love in your marriage through the good times and the bad times. <laughs> let their love cloak, well, let their love cloak you and make you strong, ready to face whatever lies ahead. Look at that. All right. That's King King and Randy. Pick up butter. You can do it. It's This cord symbolizes the everlasting love and fidelity. Uh, love and fidelity. <laughs> <laughs> your love, like this cord, ties you together and intertwines your destinies. You are no longer two. You are united as one. Stronger together in the face of adversity and capable of facing anything. Let this cord symbolize the strength of your love and unbreakable bond which will only grow as time passes. All right. Now we can remove. Can the sponsors remove wow. it the cord? Really happened. It rained. It rained Who are the sponsors? Wedding. You guys can do it. Just let yep. them. Do Levi, that. hey, Becca. Becca, go ahead and remove you're these. You're gonna, you're, you got extra duties. That's all right. There you go. All right, I think we stand up, babe. Okay. And now for the vow exchange. <laughs> Woo! Oh, this is perfect. Yeah, it's memorized. Just kidding. Right here, Alan. <laughs> okay. Is it on? Is it on? Yeah. Testing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Eula, uh, you are my everything, my best friend, who is crazy funny, smart, really goofy, beautiful inside and out. You get me? It's so unbelievable how much we compliment one another. <laughs> you are kind, <laughs> honest, passionate, loving, hardworking, caring, and very true. I fell in love with all the wonders that is you. <laughs> I love how transparent you are. Mostly. <laughs> Except for when you're hungry and you want to eat my McDonald's fries. <laughs> um, but, I mean, you, you express and communicate everything. You're all, all your feelings. You, know, you are the best sort of friend. The, for, the first moment I knew you were the one for me 
was when I figured out you laugh at the same things as me. I feel like one of our main pillars in our relationship stem from humor. Nobody has made me laugh as long or as loud as you. When I knew you had my back on anything. I also fell in love with your strong will. Watching life hit you in extremely unusual ways with sharp obstacles just to see you coming out winning. I really fell in love with that. I love how cute you are. <laughs> you got a colorful personality. What I miss the most when you're gone is the fact that you are gone. <laughs> you have the best company. You are a great conversationalist with such a unique character. I miss your aura of attention, the love. So wet. <laughs> with you, I feel warm, cozy, yet challenged. The environment you bring is the perfect way to pull the best out of me. Already we have a list of completed adventures, and yet the next adventure is always better. I promise to always be faithful, to respect you. I will always be attentive to you and always self-improve. I promise to love you forever, to celebrate you and care for you. This ring is a promise to not only love you, but to make you smile. It is a promise to massage your back every night. <laughs> to hold you when the world feels shaky. This ring is a promise to an unlimited amount of wants and needs. I vow to grow old with you, wrinkly. To always be your number one fan. Obviously to support you. I vow to burst through any threshold that try to stop us from reaching our goals. I vow to always speak to you when words are needed, as well as share in silence when words aren't. I promise to be the GPS in our relationship. <laughs> I'll always be there when you need someone to lean on, or if you're ever lost, which happens a lot. <laughs> if you are ever lost, literally or mentally, I'll be there. I am so ready and determined to say I do. I will work hard to always understand your wishes, desires, fears, and dreams, and will strive to make you happy. I vow to always walk with you, to always be your teammate, to communicate and overcome, to never stop loving you. I'm so ready for each and every adventure with the woman I love most. Is I really quiet? Hello, hello, hello. It's on. It's yeah. gonna be really quiet, loud. Samuel Gerard Nelson. I vow to love you with all my heart through the good times and bad. You taught me to be brave and confident. You provided me a home filled with love and a place to lay my worries aside. You so supported me through the hardest times of my life where I was lost in a foggy field searching for myself again. I can only hope to be the person you are when you tuck me in bed and grab my heating pad to help my hurting hips, walk me to the car before work so I can feel safe at night, wake up in the middle of the night to go to the car to grab something I forget, even when it happens to be below freezing, you're not wearing any clothes except your boxers, <laughs> and you're not wearing any shoes or socks. <laughs> when you drive home to lunch just to see me and Rhaegar, when you listen to me sing on YouTube even when you're angry with me, I consider myself beyond lucky to have you every day. I get to wake up to someone who tries and tries again. So I made a list leading up to the days I got to call you my husband. 
a list that can only cover a limited amount of days and events you have given me throughout the short 10 years. Okay. You love the art of naming. I have never felt more of a name than is Samuel. With my mind open and empty, I see you for what you are, and I vow to make sure you do too. My vow to you today is to love you like you have loved me, because you are what I think of when I define the word love. Now for the ring exchange. <laughs> just do it. Or do we just do it? Yeah, just. <laughs> Eula, you may kiss the groom. <laughs> Hey! 